Hello and welcome back to Phenology Ticker. I am Srishti Jain, Chief Product Officer of Ticker and I'll be sharing a series of videos on how to use Ticker to pick great stocks. Five videos of this series is already out. You can watch them from this playlist. In today's video, we will see how to use a screener to make our stock picking easy. Imagine yourself in a library between sweet smell of books and n number of wooden shelves. You want your favorite book. Now, Will you browse the whole library one by one for that book or you will go to the particular section where the book belongs to? I think 95% of you will choose the second option. Why? Because it's smarter and time saver. Well, then why don't we do the same by picking stocks? It's because either we don't have the right tools or the right knowledge. Don't worry. Ticker hai na? Finding the stock you want is a three-step process. First, visit ticker.phenology.in slash screener Type whatever you want and get the results. It's easy and free to use. Let's see in detail. Visit ticker.phenology.in and in the top menu, click on screener option. Here, you will see a screen like this. It has a go to screener button here. If you are not logged in, the button will say to log in to use a screener. You just have to do a simple sign up. It's free. Below are some sample screens and after that, step-by-step -step guide on how to use screener. You can try sample screens when you don't know what query to use. Let's try it. Click on Run Screener button on Promoter Rich Screen. It will give you a list of companies where promoters have a majority of stake. Here, you get a list of 107 companies where promoters have more than 70% stake as of this quarter, which is second quarter of financial year 2024. Every quarter, when the company releases new shareholding, the list changes accordingly. Now, what if you want a list where promoters have more than 80% of stake? Well, you can edit the query also. For that, write 80 in place of 70. Now, click on Run Screener button. Wow, you just moved from 107 companies to a list of 24 stocks in a matter of seconds. Amazing and quite easy, na? Now, let's go back and select Go to Screener option. Here, you will get the option to create your own screener based on your own criteria to filter out the stocks. You also have an option of usage guide so that there is no confusion on how to use screener. You can just click on it and get an idea about it. Okay, so now let's start and we will create a screener based on few ratios and filters. For example, I want stocks which have market cap between 10,000 to 20,000. So, I will write market cap in the search box here. When you start typing on the screener, it will start giving you various options. You can select the relevant one by seeing its meaning and the unit in the above section. After selecting, screener will show options of operators such as less than, greater than, equal to, plus, minus, etc. You can select according to your choice. Here, I want it to be greater than 10,000 crores. So, I will select greater than sign and just write 10,000. I don't have to write values in crores because it automatically takes it. After writing it, it again gives the option for and or or. If you want any ratio and you want other conditions to satisfy as well, then in that case, you will use and. Or if you want any of the two conditions, then you can use or between them. For example, if I want companies with either market cap more than 10,000 or price more than 10,000. In that case, I will use OR, but if I want price and market cap both to be greater than 10,000 crores, then I will use AND. Now, as per our criteria, we wanted stocks with market cap between 10 and 20,000, so we will use AND. After that, we will again write market cap and this time choose less than sign and write 20,000. Now, we will click on Run Screener button to see the results. Here, we got 150 plus companies as of today with market cap between 10 to 20,000. We can sort through the table by any column also by clicking on the arrow in the headings. Also, if from the list we want to study only banking companies, we can do so by typing the sector name in the search box. For example, when I type bank, only 5-6 banking stocks appear. If I type finance, around 10-20 companies in the finance sectors are in the results. So, this makes screening easier. If we want to limit our companies, we can add more filters, such as from the same list, give me stocks which have debt-to-equity ratio less than 
that is negligible debt. So we type the same, select our option and get the limited companies as results. So from 4000 plus stocks, we filtered to around 150 stocks and now only to around 80. We can now analyze these stocks for the fundamentals and pick the best one. What if, if you want to visit the same list later on when the market is super high, what will you do? Well, you don't have to type the filter again. You can just see this screen and use it as many times as you want in future. For that, you have to click on the save screen button. It is below the list. Write a name for it and basic explanation so that you know what this is for. I will name it stocks with low debt and uh, give a description like stocks between 10 to 20k market cap with negligible debt and then click on save button. So later when you visit screener, your screens will be showed below the search box like this. So. Let's revise once what we learned so far. There are 4000 plus listed companies in the Indian stock market. We can't analyze each and every one, but we know that what type of companies we want for our portfolio. So we can screen them and do our work in seconds. Now, how to screen them? We just have to use screener. It is free to use. It has 1200 plus ratios like profit growth, sales growth, ROE, ROCE, debt to equity, peg ratio, enterprise value, EBITDA, cash flow ratios, etc. So we can use any of the ratios with any combinations and get what stocks we want. For example, if I want stocks with price less than 100 and good sales growth and ROE and low debt to equity, I can do that in screener in seconds and get those stocks like this. If your results show more than 100 to 150 companies after filtering out, then this tells us that either we should add more filters to our research or make our screening strict because analyzing 100 companies is not easy. So I will add one more factor like uh, I want those stocks to have FII holding which is foreign institutional holding to be more than 2%. So I will add that and click on run screener. Here I got only few stocks. Now analyzing them is much more easier than analyzing 100 plus stocks. So make your screener more stricter. It is always advised to do your own fundamental analysis before investing in any company. Stock screener is only for making things easy by filtering out few companies as 95% of the companies in the stock market might not be worth investing for and manually filtering these companies will take a lot of time. So you need to do proper research over the results presented by screener and find out the companies which are worth investing in. For doing the research about the fundamentals of the company, you can click on any company name and get its A to Z details. So that's all for our stock screener feature. We hope you would have got the basics of how to use screener in Ticker. If you think that this is hard and want ready-made screens to use, then we have something for you as well. It will be covered in our next video. So stay tuned. Till then, comment your filters or what type of companies you like and we will share the query for the same which you can use in screener and get the results in seconds. Like, share and subscribe to Finlogy Ticker for more such videos. Thank you.